So, me and Matt. Not a picture. Not a picture. <laughs> are hiking the Coas Trail. And we are currently at the New Hampshire, Canada border crossing. We're gonna leave our car here and then taking a shuttle down to the White Mountains National Forest. Start right below Mount Washington and hike about 170 miles north back to our car. Let's get it going. All right, we're here, we're doing it. All right, good morning. Today is day two on the Coash Trail. And last night, me and Matt missed the campsite that we were aiming for and just stealth camped, which was less than ideal because there was no water near there other than water that was on the trail. So we'll find out in about 24 hours if uh, that was a good decision or not. But today, we're going whoop, to attempt to go up and over Mount Washington through the high peaks option of the trail. We'll see how the weather is before we make that decision. But either way, it should be a good day. All right, You're in the Alpine zone now, baby. Look at all that water. Yeah. Video. Oh. <laughs> so today is the start of day three. Yesterday was a bit more ambitious than we were expecting. Uh, we had about probably about 3,000 feet of elevation gain and about 4,000 feet, maybe 4,500 feet of elevation loss yesterday. Uh, as we went up and down Mount Washington. Uh, and we're uh, pretty hurt. So <laughs> we're going to go like seven or eight miles to see how we feel and then uh, maybe have an easy day today. We'll, uh, we'll find out. What? Pretty. Yeah. All right, walking up to the Omni Resort Hotel. This place looks massive. We're gonna grab some lunch. Ooh. All right, we're leaving the hotel now. We've had a couple of beers, but the forecast says we're supposed to get rain today, so we're gonna try to get to camp before it starts raining. We will uh, see how that goes. I think we should be okay though. Okay. We found a camp spot. Matt are about to hike up Mount Martha. So 
good news last night. We stayed at a primitive campsite that's like all the way up to Mount Martha. This is actually like the best campsite we stayed at. Every other site was like a stealth site with uh, nowhere to really hang out. So this was nice. We even made like a little stick fire in that big fire pit last night. So it was nice. Hung out, played around. I should have videoed the fire. I didn't. It was cute. Yeah. Bugs are swarming up here. Mount Martha. All over the place. All right, we're gonna go. It's way too buggy up here. And I thought we were going downhill. Nope. Still going up. Pro tip, if there's a bunch of sticks crossing the trail, generally means turn. Also, it helps to have an arrow. Today is day five, and me and Matt are walking up to Mount Star King, and oh, it's a good climb so far. Where we camped, it was like a trailhead, so there was a parking lot there. And this morning there was a bunch of uh, day hikers going up the mountain. So well, that leads me to believe that there should be a pretty sweet view up top. Well, I'm gonna find out. How's that water? We'll see. Oh yeah? Bass fill. Nice. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Marlboro. fireplace yeah oh, we just got to mount star king and there's just a fireplace here it does look like a good seat though all right sweet look at this tree just growing out of this rock well many trees all right so we just got to camp Spin that around. There we go. And uh, we're coming back this way now. Uh, so we did about 10 miles today. It was uh, a tough 10 miles because we started today going up uh, Mount Star King. And then we hit Mount Wombeck. And then we hit all three peaks of Mount Weeks. And now we're at the valley before the next mountain, which I don't know what it's called off the top of my head. Yeah, I don't know. But we're about to eat dinner and then maybe uh, go to sleep early. <laughs> I'm super tired. <laughs> what are you doing with your spoon? Kind of like it though. Keeps it out of the dirt. I just mixed my food with it. <laughs> so it's got liquid on it. I didn't want to put it in the dirt. Hmm. Okay. Holy shit is right. 
just made it to Cabot Cabin. Cabin. That's a good climb. A couple bunk beds back there. Yeah, yeah let's sign the register. All right. Whew, good climb. Well, we got our standard East Coast views. A little window through the trees. Pretty much it. All right. Moving on. Well, this is pretty random. Nice. Up on Rogers Ledge. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Me and Matt stayed at South Pond last night which uh, was pretty cool. There was a beach there, although there was a million people there. I didn't take any videos of it because I kind of forgot to, plus there was a million people there. But uh, I'm not really sure if we were allowed to camp there. So we just kind of waited for everybody to leave and then set up. Nobody bothered us, so that was nice. Today, we have like a three mile hike into Stark Village and we're gonna stay at the BNB there. It's supposed to rain any minute now, so we uh, really timed this out really well. Hopefully it shouldn't get too wet. We'll see about that. All right, so it just started raining, but we got to where we're gonna get picked up for the uh, b and And we have some coverage here, so I'm not getting super wet. But uh, yeah, she should be here in like, hopefully 10 to 20 minutes. Gonna be wet for like, another five minutes until I hop in the shower, but uh, we timed this out pretty perfectly. Excellent. 